random video time random 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 um basically i'm about to work out as you can see check out the threads the headband um yeah i just really 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 felt like coming and doing a little quick video I've really spoken about my whole losing weight and fitness and all that kind of stuff i show a lot of my meals and things i eat um, by Instagram and Facebook and I do some recipe posts on my blog as well but I don't really um, show pictures of weight loss and all that kind of stuff because it was just something for me but I just have been looking at myself and just wanted to touch on something when you have been bigger and you've been a bigger size and you've been that size for a while or you've kind of crept up you don't realize that when you lose weight that you are smaller like for instance I've lost almost three stone now and you know I still felt big and yeah technically I'm not slim because I'm not size 8 size 10 but I am sort of average now so you know size 14 is average and that's what I am now size 14 and some 12s and um, so I think a lot of ladies who lose weight still think that they're big and still can't wear certain things or they can't they they feel a certain way and I would encourage you to take pictures and look at yourself in the mirror because you know sometimes you can go days without actually standing there and looking at your body and looking at what's changed or what's got smaller and stuff because for me I had really big thighs and I was you know I didn't mind having big thighs but they were too big where I couldn't wear stiff jeans or things would get to the middle of my thighs and I couldn't pull them up anymore um, so you know my legs have decreased a lot um, my stomach as well that was a lot bigger my arms I used to hate my arms I used to always hate having them out they're still not perfect but they're looking you know a lot better and how I feel comfortable in wearing something sleeveless and where else my bum's getting smaller I'm not too happy about that but I'm sure we could fix that with some squats um, and also um, just just the look of yourself like you can just you see yourself coming out more now I'm not saying that everyone's supposed to be slim because they're not but we all can be healthy and we can all you know be the fittest that we can be um, and I think you know that's partly why I've been doing all of this healthy eating and changing my lifestyle because I wasn't happy with the way I looked, I didn't feel good. You know, I've always been pretty comfortable with the way I've looked, I've always been able to work it and dress for my size, but I wanted that little bit more. I couldn't do bare arms, I couldn't do bare legs, there was too many restrictions and life has variety, life, the spice of life is variety. So you don't wanna limit yourself to only being able to do certain things um, that you're comfortable with. Um, so I encourage you ladies to, like I said, look at yourselves. If you're already on a weight loss journey, obviously starting one or a healthier lifestyle, that's another story in itself. I'm not gonna get into that right now, but I just wanted to come on and just, for the ladies that are already doing it, um, you know, look at yourself, just keep going, keep on going because for me, if someone had said to me this time last year, you're gonna lose three stone next year, I'd be like, nah, you're, you're just you're just taught telling pork. And the fact that I've done it is just crazy. And you know, I set myself a time um, and I've not quite hit my target. I'm almost there, but um, you know, I'm very proud of what I've done and you know, how I'm looking and how I'm feeling. So like I said, a little random video. I just wanted to come and just, you know, just encourage your ladies to keep on going. You know, keep at it. Don't, you know, don't fall off because a lot of people can say, oh, I want to lose weight and then they'll do it for two weeks, three weeks, and then they just go back to normal. You know, keep on taking those little steps forward and just keep on moving forward, you know, because you're not going to jump from here to here, but if you keep taking those little tiny steps, then you'll, you'll always be moving forwards and not backwards. But anyway, I probably could ramble on for the next 10 minutes, but just, you know, wanted to just come and give my little encouragement and just share a little something with you guys. Anyway, I'm going to go and work out, go get my sweat on, <laughs> um, and I shall see you in the next video. If you like the video, thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you soon. Bye.